Thank you for stopping by Ballistic Burgers. On today's video, I'm going to be recreating the green chili cheeseburger with an extra patty from Blake's Lotta Burger. Let's get going. All right, Blake's Lotta Burger is a pretty popular, kind of a small chain. They have some restaurants throughout New Mexico, a few in Texas and a couple in Arizona. And their green chili cheeseburger is voted one of the top in the nation. And we're going to recreate it for you right now. We're gonna start off by prepping those hatched green chilies. So in this plastic bag here, and I'll explain why they're in a plastic bag, I have two fire roasted hatch green chilies. This is what they look like when they're not fire roasted and in a bag. And a good substitute for this would be the Anaheim chili. And I guess it's the same species of pepper, but the variety that actually come from Hatch, New Mexico are a little spicier. So I roasted both of these chilies on a uh, small, like a overhead broiler. And you can do this over direct heat on a grill in the broiler on your oven on the stove top you know using the burners you just want to char up the skin really good now as soon as i pulled these out of the broiler i popped them in that plastic bag to help sweat the skin off and you'll see it'll come off very easy okay, now i'm just going to cut these tops off Split these guys We'll allow some of the seeds to hang around, but not all of them. I'm just going to strip these up. Kind of bundle these together. Just going to mix these up. And there we go. So I'm using the Blackstone griddle on this cook. And right here in this zone, I have a medium high. Medium high actually going to about right here. Medium, burner's completely off right here. So for the patties, I have two quarter pound patties. This is 80, 20 ground beef. And they're fairly thin patties. So I'm just going to season the one side and that'll be the perfect amount of seasoning. This is kosher salt here, you can use sea salt. I like using, you know, kosher salt or sea salt better than table salt because there's no additives, it just, it's just salt. Okay, now one thing that Blake's does is they take their spatula and they kind of score the patio. And I'm guessing they do this to keep the burger from cupping while it's cooking. So while these guys are cooking, we're going to get those chilies on the flat top. Just a little oil down. Now I'll take the buns, get a nice little toast going on these guys. Okay, this is what we're looking for, just a light toast. Okay, got some juices pooling here. That's a good sign that these guys are ready to flip. Nice sear. Go ahead and lay down the cheese on that. Chili on top of the cheese. So these guys are finishing. I'm going to go ahead and lay down some mustard.
I'm gonna lay down four pickles, two tomato slices, some hand pulled lettuce. Two rings of onions. First patty down. Second patty down. And then we'll crown this beauty. And there we are. My version of Blake's Lotta Burger green chili cheeseburger with an extra patty. Let's give her a try. First off, the that roasted green hatch chili it's it's perfuming the air in a good way it's beautiful this is a beautiful burger mm. so this is like my perfect burger and i'll tell you why it's it's not completely crazy over the top which i mean i like over the top burgers but realistically this thing is like a perfect burger um, it's so simply dressed. I mean, mustard with, you know, that fresh sliced tomato, the, the lettuce and the onion, two patties with the cheese, and then you get that roasted hatch chili, which gives you some heat, but it's a, it's a really nice kind of, it's not an uncomfortable burning heat. It's just a, a nice kiss of heat that lets you know, hey, hatch is here. But the nice thing is, you're eating it and then the, the cool, you know, tomato and everything is actually kind of mellowing out that heat. So it's just a nice endorphin rush. Killer burger. This was a viewer suggestion actually on my Ballistic Barbecue channel. So thank you guys. Um, if you're not subscribed and I'm guessing you're not, please help support this channel by subscribing. Make sure you're ringing that bell so you get notifications. It's going to be a challenge growing a new channel here. My plan is to do one burger video a week on this channel, and this is going to be the one-stop shopping for burger lovers. So please support me and hit that subscribe button. I appreciate it. Uh, make suggestions. I appreciate those suggestions. This burger was a suggestion. See you on the next video. Cheers.